of Title 42 comes the rise in the number of migrants trying to cross into the United States illegally. Our next guest is a former journalist turned counterterrorism intel expert, and he just returned uh, from Mexico. He claims the Biden administration is actually working with coyotes to help illegals get into the country. Todd Binsman is a, is a Center for Immigration Studies fellow, and he joins us now. Todd, thank you for being with us. Um, fascinating report here. of yours referenced right here yesterday on Fox & Friends Weekend by Sarah Carter. It caught all of our attention and something we wanted to follow up on this morning with the source, you. Tell us about what you've witnessed here with the Biden administration helping Mexican officials and, I guess, coyotes facilitate illegal immigrants into the United States. That's right. So I was in Matamoros uh, for all most of all of last week. I'm now in McAllen on the other side in Texas. Uh, and I witnessed just uh, crowd after crowd after crowd pour into the river and up the Texas riverbank all day and all night. And after a while, I noticed a pattern to it that Mexican immigrants... Biden strategize for epic liberation of immigrants loses in court again, teeing up Supreme Court fight. The Biden government was rejected its appeal to maintain a lower court order that stopped it from applying a procedure that permits for the freedom of immigrants into the United States. Without court dates easing the trail for the government to make a last-ditch exertion to the Supreme Court. On Monday, a three-judge panel of 11th Circuit Court of Appeals delivered a verdict repudiating the Biden administration bid to halt a lower court magistrate's instruction from taking validity while the case works out in the courts on the facts. The Biden government now has the choice to file a crisis petition to the highest court to halt stay the lower court's resolution. The 11th Circuit panel did not by the Department of Homeland Security's, DHS, claims in court that not issue a stay would cause irreversible harm. Definitely acquiescing and ac accommodating the flow of illegal immigration in, in the swimming kind of illegal way over the border. Uh, and this was ultimately confirmed by five different immigration officials on the Mexican side uh, who said that they were working with the Americans on a WhatsApp, encrypted WhatsApp channel. I don't know about the coyotes or any of that, but definitely with the Mexican government. And this is extraordinary because almost every executive branch in the history of modern history of U.S. presidencies stop block deport, detain, do everything they can to stop illegal immigration, not to conduct an orchestration of it, which was the case here. Right, and collude, essentially, with this process. Collusion. You know, it's interesting to me that you got the information from Mexican officials. I went to the border, and I couldn't get our Border Patrol to talk to us. Um, they wouldn't tell us what was going on. Please join the conversation. Put your comments and suggestions below in the comment section. Thank you for subscribing to this news channel. You will be notified of any breaking news and new post as you become part and parcel of the McCad TV family. Please like and share McCad TV. We love you all. Please support McCad TV Foundation by joining membership and visiting Amazon UK to purchase the displayed books to aid our orphanage projects across Africa.